Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. My name is Visha and in today's video we will be doing a undecorate with me and also a clean with me. This video took me some time to do because I had started in the evening which I had to stop and cook dinner and then I started back at night. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you are new to my channel thank you so much for stopping by please hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you are notified when I upload a video. And if you are a current subscriber, thank you guys so much for coming back. And to everybody, I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. So let's go ahead and let's begin with the video. The first thing I like to do is take all my decorations off my Christmas tree. I feel like once I get the Christmas tree out of the way and the Christmas tree put up, cleaning is much easier for me when it comes to undecorating with me. So that's the first step that I like to do. As you can see there, I have a blue bin. That's where I currently keep all of my Christmas decor. But later in the video, you will see that I had to bring out a second bin because all my decor did not fit in there like I thought that it would. And I did not want to force anything down and break ornaments because I save my ornaments so that I can use them every year. We're moving through the night like we're from a different star Flying over streets and the broken hearts but they can even touch us, we found a different beat Paradise is waiting and we bought the lead Ooh, getting caught in the midst of so many that never get out of They're feeding the fears and the doubts Ooh, but we go and we run to the end and we run without shame We own the game Word of advice, when you are taking down your Christmas tree, do not do like I did. You see me putting the pieces in the box. Go ahead and wait until you are completely done. Um, put the biggest piece in the box first, then the medium piece, then the small piece. Guys, work smarter, not harder. So you're gonna see me here. I had to take everything out of the box again just so that it can fit properly. So just a word of advice to you when you decide to take down your Christmas tree, go from the biggest to the smallest. And I also did put my tree stand in there as well, so I won't lose it. I don't think you guys will see that in the video, so I just wanted to go ahead and address that as well. So I'm so happy that the holidays are done and that I was finally able to clean off the table the way that I wanted it to be clean. Um, now everybody can sit at the table when we decide to eat dinner. It was just like a hassle every single day, moving stuff, putting stuff putting it back the right way so it can look decorated and neat. We were sitting at the the bar and eating there like by the island. So 
I'm just so thankful and happy. Next year, I think I'm going to have to be a little bit more organized with my de with my decor or how of how I am going to design the table. I don't know yet. We we shall see. I don't even know if I'm going to even do a big decor on the table. I might just put some Christmas flowers there and call it a day so that we will be able to sit down. I am not a person who likes all that stuff on the table. As you can see, I am not a person who likes that much decor in the house because I don't like to feel cluttered or claustrophobic. Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? Let me be honest, I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. Let me be real here. When I see you, my heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh, na 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 na. Don't you see what's wrong with me? I need somebody to love. Oh, oh, na na. I don't. Starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking. At this point in the video, I, I am looking at it now too as well because I am editing, but I am so happy that all uh, the Christmas decor was done. It is, uh, anybody else is happy that all uh, their Christmas decor is down? I know that I am so happy that all uh, my Christmas decor is down. I put both of the two um, boxes, containers that I had, I put them outside in the storage. The only thing I have to do now is just sweep and mop the floor. And like I said, this took me well into the nighttime because I took a break so I can cook dinner. I did not want to be late with dinner, but I was, I am so happy guys. Again, I am sorry. Ace is outside. <laughs> He's barking. Him and the vet is outside playing in the backyard. So yeah. <laughs> Shooting me with words, but I won't let them bruise Even though it hurts, I won't show it to you Cause it will ricochet, I won't let it bite I will look at you and tell you that I'm alright Like a ricochet
three hours later. guys as you can see I am using the steam mop and it just was not doing a good clean for me you're gonna see that I am going to switch back to my microfiber mop I just love the fact that I can do steaming hot water <laughs> bleach and fabuloso and call it a day the steam mop was not picking up nothing that I felt like it was picking up nothing so I just went back to my microfiber mop and I'm just being realistic with you guys I prefer to sweep and mop my floors without any of the other accessories you know that everybody has I do love my vacuum but I only use it for upstairs but downstairs I just prefer to just sweep and mop my floors the old-fashioned way well my way Thank you so much guys for watching today's video i hope this video has inspired you and motivated you as well when it is time for you to take down your christmas decor or when it's time for you to do your undecorate with me that you can have this video here as a helpful point to you um only thing i can say is ladies and gentlemen let's just go ahead and get it done <laughs> so I hope you guys also have a wonderful new year. I hope you bring in the new year safe and sound and you enjoy it with your family and the people that you love so much. Until next, guys, you will be seeing me in the new year. Have a nice day.